doing at the moment. I'm in Cape Town Airport and just waiting for Davide. <laughs> Um, well, as you can see, this is the car we're going to take on our trip. It's BMW 316 1997 model. Here's what uh, Cape Town Airport looks like from inside. It looks pretty nice. I mean, this is all new, basically. Last time I was here, um, this didn't exist like two, well, two years ago. They're still, they're still building it. And it's almost complete. There's still a lot of construction going on outside that you can see. This is the international arrivals terminal. How's it going, man? <laughs> Not too bad. Ciao. <laughs> How was the flight? The flight was good. Uh, well, I had what? It was quite long. Emirates is good food. Yeah. You have nice. lamb for breakfast, lamb for lunch, and lamb for dinner. So it's like, uh, it's good, it's good. Okay, check out the t shirts. Cape Town, here we are. And we are just walk we're, we're walking, we're driving through. This part of Cape Town, which is leading to uh, where the Greenpoint Stadium is located. So, actually, you can see it there on your right hand side. So, we are here with Shakir. If you'd like to tell us, um, the area we're in is Greenpoint, as Dominic said earlier on. Um, and the stadium that you see now was once a small stadium, and they redeveloped it into a stadium that would be able to host a World Cup match. I think it's now. At capacity, a, I know. think I think it's about sixty thousand seater. I might stand corrected. And uh, the quarterfinals is going to be played here. All right. Okay. So right, we're outside the north entrance to the Greenpoint Stadium. Um, it's very impressive. I mean, what do you think about this? I mean, how you know how is this kind of stadium going to affect um, the people here in Cape Town? First of all, it's going to bring the little jobs that it will create. Yeah. It will create much needed jobs. Um, secondly, we'd also have a proper venue to host football matches that would be easily accessible as well to most of Cape Town yeah. because of the rapid transport system that they're building. Uh -huh. You know Cape Town has a lot of cars on the streets. Mm. Um, this would reduce the amount of cars, private cars that's actually been yeah, right. used on the roads. So it's going to have an effect on our quality of air. Mm. It's going to be less pollution as well. And what about the aspects of security? How's that going to... Security wise, I know there's a lot of stories around the world saying that security risk, be careful, and, but with any big city you have to be. Mm. I mean, New York and London and everybody has its own uh, its yeah, problems sure. with crimes. With us, we've been prepared. You know, I don't foresee any big problems yeah. with that. And it's in the interest of the, of the country as well to make sure that... Exactly. You know, the tourists are safe. Safe. When they come yeah. Okay, great. All right, thanks for that. <laughs> 